Hey, Jimbo. As you know, I am such a busy bitch. So I thought that I'd call up some of my season one Canada's Drag Race sisters because they say that I don't text them back. You don't answer my messages anymore. When you need something, you text me. I message you, you don't respond for a week or so. On a personal note, do I ever respond to your texts? You usually do respond to my texts, and then this last one you didn't in preparation for this question, just so you could have your storyline. What is this inner saboteur storyline that you're projecting on me? When you don't respond, that's actually you <laughs> responding. Bitch, I'm busy. Cause I'm a busy bitch. Ring-a-ding-ding, -ding. hey Jimbo. I know you are so busy being robbed, but what else keeps you busy? You were the one kept busy robbing me. I've been busy oh, just like working, were... twirling, having fun, mm. having the best time, and I'm busy, bitch. Wow. So I'm glad I could make time for you. Thank you so much for making so much time for me. I know you've been really sore and achy from losing so much, but hey, you're busier than I am trying to prove relevance, but that's what being a Drag Race girl is all about. Ding! You missed your mother's smell, my goddamn fingers. Do you remember how iconic your Snatch Game was? I sure do. I remember it like it was goddamn yesterday. <laughs> do you remember how iconic your Snatch Game wasn't? Call me now! What would Joan Rivers say to me for not texting Boa back. She probably would say, who gives a Who the is Boa anyway? <laughs> Jimbo, you are such a fan favorite, a beloved. But what people actually don't know is that you're such a little Um, I think people do know, actually. Those that did <laughs> see. You're like, no, no, no. Know. Let's just clear this up. Everyone does know. Yeah, I think that that, you know, it's a good side of everybody. Everyone, you have to have that bitchiness. That's part of the whole fun of it. Jimbo, whenever we were getting ready for the runways, you took forever to get ready. Probably the longest of everybody on the cast, but you also looked the worst. Make that make sense. <clears throat> Sorry. You just made me <laughs> not, choke. Not... not um... <laughs> Not um, like you had to like brace yourself like, oh. Did I take a long time? Yeah, that's what happened when you have complicated costumes and you're serving body, you're serving padding, you're serving corset, you're serving tits, you're serving new wigs, you're serving new shoes. So a lot of the girls that aren't doing those extra steps, they're just walking around in their body. It's a little bit easier, but when you do complicated drag with complicated looks, it takes longer. Did you watch my Peas project yet? Have you been too busy to get on WoW Presents Plus to see Jimbo vs. Peas now streaming on WoW Presents Plus? I am so proud of your pee project because I know you also like to get peed on, so that's why this whole pee thing has happened. I'm no, proud of you. No, it's about my phobia of peas that I was traumatized by as a child. You don't actually have a phobia of peas. You're just creating mm. these storylines to further your drag race World of Wonder mm. Presents No, you're career. projecting again because that's what you do. I have authenticity. <laughs> One last and final question. Are you watching Canada's Drag Race available on Thursdays on Crave Canada and WoW Presents Plus? I sure am. Yeah, I love it. Whose team are you on? And are you excited to see me finally step down? I am on Team Pythia. I love Pythia so much. I think she's so cool. And am I ready for you to step down? Yeah, I am. I think it's enough, enough's enough. The world's been through enough during the pandemic. It's time. It's <laughs> time for someone else. Well, anyways, I'm gonna go find a pussy to pet. I have to run. Thank you for your time. I'll and see what? you soon. Don't text me back, okay? <laughs> no problem. I wore no pants for you today. Let's see. Ooh, ooh. Oh, wow.